friends. Hello. Today, my friend Granny Christy and I are going to share a story with you. This is Grandma Calls Me Beautiful. It's written by Barbara M. Juice and illustrated by Barbara Lavallee. I'll hold it up close so you can okay, see the pictures. That's a good idea. <laughs> to do, tell me our story. Beautiful made herself small as a callow sprout and nestled against Grandma's side. A story? But there are so many. Which one will I choose? You know, Tutu, our story, the beautiful one. Grandma picked up a string and began. Once upon an island in the deep blue sea, a new baby girl was born. That was me, said Beautiful. I was the baby girl. So you were, said Grandma, smiling. Open your eyes, said the grandmother, so I can see who you are. The baby opened her eyes and the grandmother looked inside. Aloha, she said. You're bright as a cuckoo torch. Your breath is as sweet as breadfruit pudding. Oh, and your skin is soft as kappa cloth. I will call you beautiful because you are. As Grandma wove the rest of the talk story, Beautiful's fingers twitched along. The village sang to Beautiful. Aunties beat the kappa cloth. Tap, tap, tap. Papas kneaded the soil. Pat, pat, pat. And spotty dogs barked at the noonday sun. Woof! The sea danced for Beautiful. Seaweed swayed to the rhythm of the waves while fish twirled through holes in the bright caudal reef. At last the grandmother touched noses with Beautiful so she could share her breath. Then she held her upside down so she could walk on the sky. Finished. Grandma tucked the string away. Toot toot, said Beautiful. The chickens have fancy feather colors. Ah... Uh, they're puffed up with colors. And the piglets and dragonflies and birds, even the land snails are like jewels in the trees. Yes, they sing about their color. But my hair is plain black. Black is the color of the deep, dark night, snapping with stars. And my skin is brown. Brown is the color of a kalo field, kneaded smooth by many feet. Tutu, am I still beautiful? Beautiful is who you are. What if I grew big? Then you'll be big beautiful. What if I grew very, very big and you grew very, very small and I sat on your lap and squashed you flat? <gasps> then I'd squeeze myself out and sit on your lap. Sometimes Mama says I have minnows squirming under my skin. Then you're wiggly, but you're still beautiful. Sometimes I scare Rooster just to hear his big noise. Mm, then you're a little bit naughty, but still, you're beautiful. Beautiful uncurled the fingers of Grandma's hand and kissed the soft inside. Aloha, aloha, beautiful, Grandma sang. You're the song of the village and dance of the deep blue sea, part of the mamas and papas and the dear little babies and me. You are who you are, bright as a cuckoo -cuc torch, sweet as bread pudding, soft as kappa cloth. Forever and for always, beautiful. And that is Grandma Calls Me Beautiful. I hope you enjoyed that story as much as we did. Thank you mm. so much for watching <laughs> us. We'll see you again soon. Bye. Bye. Love you.